So you might be in a situation where you want to go ahead and enable your developer options inside of your particular Google Pixel, Samsung Galaxy, whatever you have. Now doing this is actually very basic and it really doesn't take too much time at all. So the very first thing you're going to want to do is you want to go and make your way over into your settings application of your Android phone. So hop inside of settings and what you're going to want to do here is you basically just want to go ahead and essentially make your way down into your developer options. So come down into here and what you want to do here is you want to go and click on system and then you want to go and scroll down until you see a little option that usually says something like about phone or about something like that. Now if it's not available here, you can also go into about phone, which shows here, and you'll find it here. Now what you want to do here is you want to scroll down until you see a little option that says build a number. So you should be able to see it at the very bottom. If not, it should be somewhere here. All you want to do is basically tap onto your build number multiple times and you will see a little option that says you are now a developer. So all you have to do is go and tap on this build number multiple times, and then you'll go and see that it will tell you that you're a developer, and that's really all you're going to have to do. From this point, you can hop back out, and then you'll see this little option. To get into your developer options, you want to click on System once again, and here is where you'll see your developer option come up. So all you're going to want to do here is tap on Developer Option, and all you're going to have to do here is basically just go through and modify whatever settings you want to. Here is basically just free reign. You can just change whatever you want to. You can modify whatever you want to, but again, be careful. And you can allow or disallow or turn on or turn off your particular developer mode options by just toggling this on or off, depending on whichever way you want to go and modify it. So that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.